Hey everybody, welcome back to Mark Twain Lake Fishing Intel and we're doing another guide spotlight here at Mark Twain Lake. Uh, we got a new guide, Keith Williams. Uh, he's going to guide for some crappie and maybe a little bit of bass just depending on the time of year and if the bass are uh, biting because they're, they're kind of a finicky fish here at the lake to actually, to actually you know, try to go out and hammer them every day. They're a little fickle. Yeah. At the right time of year we can go out and have a really good time and have good numbers of fish we can catch. Right, so I'm going to turn it over to him. He's going to go over uh, his guide service, uh, what, what kind of equipment he uses, uh, boat, whole nine yards. So I'm going to turn it over to him. He's going to he's going to take it from here. So thanks for joining me today, Keith. Uh, nice to be here with you, Jason. I'm running a Skeeter bass boat. It's a 20 foot FX with a 250 Yamaha on it. It came from 154 Marine. Sonny and Charlie take great care of all their customers. I don't know what I would do personally without them. The equipment that I'm running on the boat is I'm running a Garmin up front with a 12 inch screen. It is live scope. Most of what I'm doing at this time is live scoping. I, I thoroughly enjoy it. I love watching the fish react. I love seeing how they come up on the baits. And it's a lot of fun to see new people see this. It's really an amazing technology to see these fish and how, how they act to your bait down there. Absolutely. So that's what we're doing at this time. We'll move later into the year. Once we get later in the year, we'll start moving up onto bedding crappie. That is another experience that's a lot of fun. Love to take new people out at that time of the year and let them catch these bedding fish and seeing just how much fun it is to catch fish under a bobber. Yeah, that's one of the best times to catch them. It is. You can get on fish and just keep catching them. Yep. And it doesn't take a the skill level for that is really, it's not that high. You can have a lot of fun. You can take young people, kids. I take everybody. I take my kids, I take their friends, and I take a lot of other people out right now. That's why I wanted to get into guiding, just because I enjoy it. I enjoy seeing people catch fish. Mm -hmm. And, you know, teaching people how to fish, or if they're, you know, if they're not sure what to do in this situation. That's what guides are for, you know. Not just catching fish, but to, but to teach as well. Correct. Correct. We like to get out there on the lake. We, we enjoy teaching people how to do it. Absolutely. And what we're seeing and why, you know, why we're doing what we're doing. It, it is fun for us to do that. Absolutely. And so when you live scope them, you do have the double seat set up in the front with the all aboard marine uh, mount work. You want to explain that? To I do. I, I have a double seat set up up front. There's two people can sit down. A third person can stand right behind us so you can watch what's going on. You can actually see the fish reacting, how they're coming up on the bait. The equipment that I'm using, I use what Jason has said, I use an all aboard marine mount. This mount allows me to either set it up so that I can move my live scope with my trolling motor, or I can move it with a hand mount, or I can move it with my foot. There's a lot of, I mean, when I move with my foot, it's separate of my trolling motor. There's a lot of ways that I can set up on these fish. I can hit my spot lock, move my, move my all aboard marine mount over to where I can look at the fish, and it pretty much stays there. The boat will move around, I can keep on the fish. That way my hands are free, I can help other people with what they're doing and how to set up on them. You want to talk to them about your uh, contact information and all that good stuff, how they get a hold of you? Sure. The best way to get a hold of me right now is just to call me direct. You can hit me on my, on my Facebook page, which is uh, Mark Twain guide service. You can get me on that or you can go ahead and just call me straight up. It's 314-574-3183. Give me a call anytime. I'd love to talk with you and set something up. Good stuff and, and also don't forget that uh, you can also go to Mark Twain Lake Fishing Intel under the Fishing Guides tab on the Lake Resources uh, tab and uh, check out all of our great guides here at Mark Twain Lake and he's going to be added to the list. Glad to have him. He's going to bring a lot of knowledge to everybody out here on the lake, uh, guiding or just uh, fishing knowledge in general. So uh, thanks again for watching Mark Twain Lake Fishing Intel. Thanks for joining me today, Keith. And uh, we'll see everybody on the next one.